How dry should your firewood be? Well, rule of thumb is less than 20% moisture content, 15 to 20% or so. I've got my moisture meter here and I've always wondered, is this just measuring the outside of the firewood? And is it accurate, an accurate estimate as to what is on the inside? So I've got my basket of firewood here. Let's check the moisture content of a piece of firewood and then split it in half and see if it's different on the inside. I've got this piece of split oak. It's about four inches by four inches. And if I stick the meter into the end, I'm reading 16.7. And if I stick it on the outer edge here, 16. 16.0, 15.9. So now what I want to do is split this in half and then we'll measure it where we split it. All right, let's see what we've got here. 25.2. Twenty four point five. So before splitting this piece, I got a reading of 16% moisture content on the side. After splitting, it measured about 25% in the middle. So about 9% higher moisture content in the middle, which makes me wonder, what about a piece that I know is well seasoned? Here's another piece of oak, and this one I know was split and covered for the past 15 months. So let's check out this one and see how it reads. All right, so this one, 14.2%. Let's split it and see what we get. Right, freshly split right in the middle. 20.3. About 20%. So even this fully seasoned piece of wood still has 4% higher moisture content in the middle. So what does that tell me? I don't know, you know, you're not gonna go re-splitting all your wood to check it. And I guess if you have your 15 to 20% on the outside, maybe that counts as dry enough. What do you think? Uh, I'm kind of surprised. I was kind of hoping this would have been 16% all the way through, especially being well over a year uh, sitting covered and drying. So uh, it definitely is better than the other piece, which is not uh, fully seasoned, but we're still, uh, well, I guess we're within our boundaries. You know, we're still within the 15 to 20%. We had 16 on the outside. It was about 20 on the inside. So not too bad. That's where we want to be. But I guess the goal is to really try to hit that 15, 16% on the outside. And then you'll know the inside is going to be within range. So what did you think of this little unscientific experiment? I thought it was pretty interesting because it's something I've wondered about for quite a while. I'd love to hear from you about how you store and season your firewood and how far out are you? I know a lot of you are like two years ahead in firewood production, which is really ideal. So I think I'd better get to work. <laughs> if uh, you enjoyed this video or if you enjoy this type of content, and if you're watching from YouTube, you can click on one of these other videos and check those out. If you've not yet subscribed on YouTube or followed on Facebook, Instagram, or TikTok, I invite you to join me. I do appreciate you being here, and as always, I am really glad you're here, and I look forward to seeing you next time.